this is why the narcissist will never let you go. In some situations, the narcissist will discard you and then they will move on to someone else. But that's not what I'm talking about in this video. In this one, I'm talking about narcissists who are more possessive and controlling. And if you are dealing with someone like this, it's likely that you are their grade A primary source of supply. So in these situations, the narcissist will never let you go. They will never let you escape or be free. They will never release their hold on you because they don't want you to act or do as you wish. They want you to remain under their control, which is why they confine and imprison you. It's why they isolate you and cut you off from other people because they want to be your only source of influence. You may be under the illusion that the narcissist has gained access to your life and that you need to get them out. But it doesn't work that way because you don't even have a life of your own. You're not even experiencing real life because they have brought you into their fake world, into their false reality. And to achieve this, they had to strip you of your power, of your identity and character traits, of everything that makes you who you are. So that you could be a false character in their fake world. Because nothing real can exist in their world. It would destroy the illusion. It would bring the truth to light which is the last thing that they want. So you have to be fake too. You can't have any real identity of your own. You have to be whoever they need you to be so that the false narrative can continue. So what do you do when your entire world is fake? You have to resort to visualization. You have to use your imagination to represent objects, situations and information as something more positive and productive, as something that will be more beneficial for you. You have to picture in your mind the things that you want in and out of your life because that is how you're going to heal and recover because you can't get them out of your life once they've got a foot in the door they're never going to leave it benefits them to remain with you so they're going to hold on to you for dear life they're going to trap you in their web in their world of lies and deception so you have to remove yourself from their world because that is the only way that you'll be free. The narcissist will pull you in. 
but then you have to be the one who leaves because they can't change, move or adapt. They stay the same and sometimes they get worse as time goes by as they begin to feel more comfortable around you. But they will continue to repeat the same behaviors until the day they die. They will only adapt if they think that it benefits them. They won't do it for you. It's only to further their own agenda. The primary trait of a narcissist is that they can't adapt or change. Instead, they will blame you and resent you because they know that they need you more than you need them. And they also know that in fact, you would be a lot happier without them. but they're still not going to leave and you won't be able to get rid of them because they're not going to go anywhere. They need you, they feed off you, they depend on you for their own survival so you have to be the one who leaves. The narcissist may cheat they may keep other people as secondary sources if you're no longer meeting their needs. But that doesn't mean that they're going to leave. They will still keep you on the shelf for when they need you. But they will entertain other sources of supply when they go out. And they will keep you at home as their primary source. Because they need to have other options at the ready. Just in case something goes wrong. Because they always find a way to mess things up. So they need to be prepared. They need to have people ready to support them. Thank you for watching. If you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up. Share your thoughts in the comment section. Hit the subscribe button to receive the notifications. If you would like to support the channel, you could donate at paypal.me slash narcsurvivor. You could book a one-on-one -on -one with me on my website. It's narcsurvivor.co.uk. Thank you for watching, and I'll talk to you soon.